So I am back in France tonight, heading to Spain tomorrow. Um, today was pretty good. Drove from Italy back to France. Um, wasn't too bad of a drive, just a few hours. But I think it's, um, I think toward the end of this trip, it's, I'm, I'm realizing, you know, how much I'm learning about myself. And tonight as I was walking, you know, along the Mediterranean Sea, that for the first time I feel human. No one's yelling at me. No one's picking me up hot. No one's telling me to hurry. No one's calling me names. I'm making my own choices, doing my own things, you know, making mistakes, I'm screwing up, but I'm not being punished for it because I'm human. Because as an adult, you shouldn't be punished for making silly mistakes like missing an exit or wearing the wrong dress or having a bra strap showing or simple things that happen to you as a human in just daily life. Like you shouldn't be yelled at because you left a towel on the bathroom floor. Because from what I understand, I'm trying to think, I don't think I've ever read a story or a headline that said, you know, a man dies because someone left a towel on the bathroom floor. I could be wrong though. Um, there's so many things that I'm able to do and I find it so freeing. I find it very exciting. I find it um, amazing stressful um but overall it's been a really good vibe and you know tonight I was sitting there at the water and I was just thinking of how far I had come 10 years ago I didn't think I'd be in this spot six months ago I didn't think I'd be in this spot and here I am living just living just doing what I want when I want and enjoying things and different experiences and making great memories, which is what I did. I took a ton of pictures. Um, you know, enjoyed myself. It's a really good feeling to do this and you don't have to be with someone to enjoy a trip like this. You can do this on your own. You can do it with a friend. You can pretty much do it with anybody and the outcome's gonna be the same. As soon as you put any kind of expectations on anything, it's already ruined because you're setting yourself up. With this trip, I had no expectations. Um, and so far, it's been, it's been great. I kind of don't want to go home because I know at home, I have writing that's waiting for me. I have decisions to make. You know, I have all kinds of stuff going on back home. And here, I just have to stay out of the... Uh, ridiculous heat and for whatever reason the refrigerators here don't work very well drinks are not very cold and I don't know why they don't use ice but um I'm happy to go back home but I'm also kind of like man if I could just stay here for a couple more weeks that would be amazing and this is huge coming from a person who is kind of an introvert I wasn't always an introvert I used to like to go out and have fun and meet people and talk and after that relationship I became a different person I think there's a part of me that burned out like a light that burned out and right now I'm trying to get that light back and it's getting there I went into two crowds tonight and my heart rate was fine that's pretty big so I'm happy about that it wasn't uh, as horrible as it used to be so that light in my I guess in my brain I kind of think is uh getting ignited again. And I was talking about it tonight and I'm never gonna let anyone do anything like that to me ever again. Never again. Will I let anyone put me down or abuse me or call me names or make me feel like I'm less than or try to make me feel like I'm not good enough just because I am who I am. I do leave towels on the bathroom floor. Not all the time, but I've done it. I'm guilty, I'm definitely guilty. And so far no one's died from it, but you know, I have a lot of faults, um, a lot of flaws, a lot of different things that I have just because I'm human. And I can't be with someone that expects me to change because they don't like who I am. So I think it's um, a, re a really good learning experience. 
So, um, but yeah, so that's it from uh, my last night in France. Tomorrow night, I will be coming to you from Spain and then Texas. Hmm.